Well, it was below zero yesterday, but today people were outside once again. Northern News Now's Cara Cop made her way to the cold front, an outdoor event that some would say only would happen in Minnesota. Only in the Northland would there be an event celebrating the cold of winter. We got so lucky with the weather. It is a gorgeous day. The sun is even out. The temperature is above zero. Um, and we are out here celebrating the best of winter fun. Folks young and old came out for the sixth annual Cold Front Festival just days after the temperature was below zero. Emma Kopp, who came all the way from Esco, says the cold never bothered her anyways. It's nice. It's a lot better than it was like yesterday. It's a lot warmer. Cop was out enjoying a variety of different frosty activities offered this year, taking advantage of the newfound warm weather by hitting the skating rink, the sledding hill, and even the new curling rink. But Cop's favorite cold front activity, the youth dog sledding. It was really fun. We got to go on a little loop around, and it was fun to just go on and see the dogs. It may still be the middle of winter, but as a Northlander, Cop was ready to enjoy the frosty air. A lot of snow gear, snow pants and boots and a jacket and hat and mittens usually. From Kinsey Building to the Cross Country Ski Loop, it seems that not even the bitter cold weather can stop Northlanders from playing in the snow. You can dress in a bunch of layers and still get out and enjoy winter and enjoy the outdoors um, and celebrate winter with this event. It's about wellness too, you know, it's about physical health and mental health and getting outside and enjoying what we have. In Duluth, Car Cop, Northern News Now. And although the Cold Front Festival only lasted through today, organizers are already making plans for next year.